Hi, I'm Dr. John Perlman, Beverly Hills Plastic Surgeon, and I want to thank you for what I consider to be a very good question that you posted on Real Self, and that is, what does one do with wrinkling of lower eyelid skin? Well, first of all, you have to realize that the lower eyelid skin is the second thinnest skin of the body, and there's an important muscle beneath it that supports the eyelid uh, to protect the eyeball. So we have to be careful not to be too aggressive because everyone has heard of the poor patient who has a retracted or bowed lower eyelid after surgery causing scarring. So it's an area where my own feeling is I don't want to ever be heroic. I want to be cautious and conservative. And consequently, patients have to realize that the effect of pulling the eyelid skin taut cannot be really replicated uh, with surgery without risk of the tension pulling the lid down and creating major complications and undesirable uh, outcomes. So for somebody who has fatty bags, and you can tell by looking in this area in the mirror and raising your eyeballs toward the ceiling, looking upward, and if it's accentuated, it usually is fat, and that can be removed surgically with a small incision on the lining side of the eyelid. When that is being done, very often we'll accompany that by what's called a skin pinch, a fairly well-hidden small incision under the eyelashes uh, not that visible, that allows us to conservatively remove uh, literally a pinch of skin. And it puts tension on the skin and, and, and helps. It doesn't eradicate all wrinkles. It certainly won't. It doesn't stop you from smiling and contracting the muscle that will cause wrinkling. But at least at rest, the uh, wrinkles uh, will, will be less noticeable and, and softened. Uh, as a, an alternative or perhaps in addition to surgery, we'll offer patients who don't need a surgical procedure or need something in addition to the surgery, uh, peels, either a chemical peel, which can be fairly mild and safe, uh, less dramatic outcome, but, but kind of a gentle approach to it, or even a fractionated CO2 laser peel, which is uh, more effective. It's more expensive also because of the technology involved, but that can create a more dramatic improvement. Keep in mind, without being very aggressive, no one can really promise you a, a complete removal of the wrinkles. What we want to do is soften them and make them look better. Finally, many of my patients who come in, uh, into the uh, office just receive small amounts of, of uh, zeaman or botulinum toxin injected along the rim here. And uh, it, it's pretty safe. I've never had a complication from doing it in that area. And it just softens those expression wrinkles. That, in addition to injection of the zeaman or the botulinum into the crow's feet, can really make a, a nice difference. So be conservative, be safe, uh, but if we can be of help to you and make you feel happier about the way your eyelids look, well, consider it. Thank you very much for listening. I appreciate your time.